Hi, this is William Kane, and I'd like to share some information that will be helpful to you to enhance your appearance. It's the issue of contrast level, which most people never think about. The contrast level of a person is measured by the difference in tone between the hair and the face. There are three types of contrast. A high contrast, medium, or low. A high contrast person for example, has black hair and white skin. Medium contrast has light brown hair and white skin. And low contrast would have black hair and black skin. Another example of low contrast would be a blonde who has light skin and light hair. Our research reveals that if you duplicate your contrast level in your outfit, you will enhance your appearance. For example, a high contrast person who wears a blue blazer and a white shirt will have a high contrast outfit matching their hair and face contrast level. They will enhance their appearance. An example of this would be Bruce Lee who had black hair and light skin. A medium contrast outfit would, for example, be a beige jacket and a pale blue pastel shirt and a low contrast outfit, for example, let's say Marilyn Monroe wanted to wear something that would draw additional attention to her. Well, she, since she's a low contrast blonde, she should wear a low contrast outfit, for example, a white dress. And if you've seen Marilyn Monroe in a white dress, you know that enhanced her appearance. Not that she really needed much enhancement, but everybody could use a little help. Now, Manhattan Makeovers does research to find out what actually is effective for people. And I want to tell attorneys something very important. The contrast level doesn't apply to you when you're at work. There are different rules entirely. We'll discuss them in a new video. But for most people, especially salespeople or other professionals, or if you're on a date or in a social situation, if you replicate your contrast level in your outfit, you're going to be a winner. And I hope this helps you in your next encounter with other people.